Look at this. I'm freaking huge. Freaking huge. Peekaboo. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> Welcome. I am your master level expert fitness trainer, Alex Diaz, aka Mr. Freaking Huge. And I'm going to be answering another question and about Jogger's nipple. So let's go to it. Vetus Forever. As part of the cardio workout, I run 20 minutes on a treadmill by which I burn some 200 to 250 calories. However, recently when I finished running, I have a burning sensation in my chest. On the chest. When I remove the t-shirt and check, I feel I feel the nipple has become puffy due to uh, due to which the burning sensation was occurred has occurred. I browsed on the internet and found that it is a problem called jogger's nipple. Would this cause more problems? Please advise. So your issue is with uh, it's, it's, jogger's nipple is also referred to um, a nipple fissure, which I, you know, I talked about fissure in the anal well, the anal, in the colon uh, uh, video in my previous videos about you know the bloody stools and all that. So same. Uh, thing with, with you with you would be nipple fissure which is just um, like cracking of your nipple and you can actually bleed believe it or not like some actually some runners actually after they do their marathons and all that stuff um, they actually bleed sometimes so um, since well th this is not for you but if, if there's if there's like you know athletes and competitive athletes that are watching my videos and they do marathon and stuff like that um, and it's warm weather and you are a male you are allowed to be shirtless and that will completely correct the issue but since you're talking about a treadmill if you are doing a treadmill at home I would recommend that you just do it without a shirt um, and if you're in a gym then obviously you can't do that um, unless they, they allow you to but if you're in uh, your house or you are um, outside running and it's warm, and you're a man. Then, um, if the law you know allows, then you could you know run shirtless, and that way there's no rubbing of your shirt, which will call it, which will cause the the nipple fissure. So, well, um, jogger's nipple. There's a lot of names for the that term, but um, so. So, but if you are in a gym and you want to, you know, jog and have a shirt on, I would recommend that you use some kind of synthetic material, um, and like, you know, silk or something like that, some kind of synthetic material, and, um, but also where you could put, like, tape, you know, you could put, like, a liquid bandage, you could put some kind of, like, uh, you know, medical tape on it, um, I would put some kind of also petroleum gel, gel um, or some kind of cream that will help and um, then put a tape over it and that way the shirt doesn't rub against you know your nipple so when you're running your shirt is you're sweating and it's tight to your skin when you're running your shirt is just rubbing up and down and that causes that irritation you have in your nipples so um it's not from my knowledge it doesn't cause any other issues or problems from what i know um but this, the simplest of things you could do is just tape your nipple and um you know i wouldn't wear a white shirt if you're going to do that because then they'll see it <laughs> but uh you could do that um i'm pretty sure they provide you some kind of creams sorry some kind of creams that um you could apply to help with the you know the the sore, the, the, not the soreness, but the, the irritation you have, um, and that's pretty much it that I could think of for this. No one's really asked me that, this question because I don't have any like, um, I don't train any like marathon athletes and all like that. But, but from what I from what I know is, um, just shirtless would be the best. Apply a cream, bandage it, tape it, and um, use synthetic materials. Okay, that's just that's the only thing I could think of, and that's it for this video. So, 
um, make sure you like comment and subscribe both my channels up there <laughs> and all that uh, go to my fan page as well and if you're not subscribed then that's not sexy man. you're freaking huge <laughs> take care